Yo, shout out to Jiggy Lifestyle for having me, man. Thanks. It's your boy Haas. Show love. Word, man. I appreciate Good y'all. Vibe. All the time. Word. Shout out, shout out Tribe Jesus Treats. Shout out, shout out King Beats. You mm-hmm. feel me? Shout out, shout out Safari's own. We in the building. Follow the rabbit. We already know. IG, you ready? Follow me at Enlighten them 45. You know, it's just good vibes. Yeah. Good vibes it's with vibes Jiggy, you already know. All day. Me and my tribe do what we want to. So much snakes, but I know how to move through the jungle. I don't give a fuck who you know, my crew is slumpy. Feeling like Mark me at 9 4, I son. Oh, yeah, I was saying, I respect I respect those that never stood before that's looking at ways, different ways of staying, but I feel like it need to be a. a, a I don't want to say stressing, but we need to be more. Uh huh. I would say. It gotta be something transferable. Like this energy, it gotta be transferred to focusing on economics, focusing on political science, focusing on financial literacy, getting an understanding of um, more impactful ways that in the black community we gonna make a difference rather than just focusing solely on, like you said, the sensationalized reaction. Mm-hmm. Everybody reacting. You feel me? I mean, I can understand the protesting. You know what I'm saying? But I feel like it's not what you do, it's how you go about doing it, you feel me? And there's a lot of other factors that's either being overlooked or totally ignored, you know what I'm saying? That we are also affected by, you feel me? I see, you know, the coronavirus, you know, I know it's, it's, it's an actual thing, you feel me? A lot of people is affected by it. And me also being a black man, you know, with the injustice, with the police going on, I can understand how people feel. But honestly, from my disposition and looking back in history and seeing like the repetition on, on the methods on how they go about implementing like the oppression onto us, right. I feel like we should be revitalizing and figuring out new ways to implement methods to get different solutions or different um, outcomes than what we used to. And I feel like what we're doing now is just something that we've seen in repetition at some point in time in history and prior to now, you feel what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And you, you, do you agree with you agree I agree with that? This is repeating something. So I'm a bit, I'm a bit desensitized, you feel me? For the need to act in ways that I see people acting. I feel like we need to look at where it counts. And where it counts to me is economics, economically. You know what I'm saying? Um, we need to be looking at exactly how the game is being played, you feel me? This is a financial game, you know what I'm saying? And mm. however way socially we fall into the into the dominoes or into the game that's being played, that that is nonetheless the the, the, the end goal. Like it is a financial game. It is it's, it's about power. And once we start wrapping our minds around this financial literacy and figuring out our best ways to manage and capitalize upon the things that we seem to be distracted by because of other things. I feel like we could really start seeing like gain in those type of avenues that we trying to alleviate ourselves. Cause right now we have no foundation. So I feel like everything that we do, it doesn't fall on nothing that can sustain itself. You right. feel me? And that's what I've been seeing. Like, don't get me wrong, we had great people like Malcolm X, Martin Luther King, um, Fred Hampton, you know, you had you had plenty of you go, a lot of greats, you feel me? But we they all echoes now, you feel me? We don't see a lot of wisdom that they was projecting and implementing during their time being utilized and refined now in ways to to, to, to capitalize. You feel what I'm saying? Mm. And with that being said, I just feel like we need to we need to figure out a different approach. This this is not working. You feel me? I feel like we're we're emotionally reacting to things rather than responding. Things like this need to happen and we need to have a place where we all can come and conjugate and we can all feel that. But before we react or respond or act on anything, we fully understand all realms of the situation we in together, collectively. But we mm-hmm. don't even think that way, because like I said, we like a foundation. You feel me? Jewish people, you feel me? They go through what they go through. They conjugate. They come together collectively, and they come up with solutions or, or have a way they want to go about alleviating the problem they dealt with us. We too divided amongst too ourselves. Divided. You feel me? You see it with all the black-on-black crime. Do I feel like it's in a means to justify or, or to defend against... The, 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 the police um, brutality, no, you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, I'm a man that feel like 
in order for my in order for me to be able to blame or put my my foot or point the finger at anything, I gotta make sure I'm being fully accountable and responsible for myself. You feel me? And if we moving like that and dealing like that, then everything would be everything is stick. You feel me? Everything would be what it's supposed to Sustainable. be. Sustainable. But it's not. It's not like that. This is why we got certain people protesting with the right intents, and you got other people utilizing that opportunity to loot and mm. do things. That's not. You feel me? We, so what you feel about that looting thing? The looting thing, I don't agree with it. You feel me? I feel like I kind of peeked that when we was talking earlier and shit. I was like, yeah, I'm not jacking. Really feeling that vibe right there. Because, hey, my fault, bro. Um, you this, it, it dilutes the our motive, our intentions, and the reason why we out there. You know what I'm saying? And if we trying to project a message or convey a message, you know what I'm saying? We need to make sure that we are doing the most efficient or optimum way on conveying that you feel what i'm saying mm. and i say in looting creates controversy you feel me it, cre it creates questioning or, or doubt you feel me reasonable doubt at that you feel what i'm saying and i don't feel like we need none of that for where we are we need to whatever points we trying to relate it need to be precise you feel me it can't be no room for nobody to say anything but the fact of the matter is like we don't have a foundation so you mm -hmm. got people that's selfish that see this opportunity and capitalize upon it. And you got those that really care and is out there. And until we find a way to situate that amongst ourselves, I feel like inevitably whatever we do, you feel me, is going to somehow have some type of loophole, some type of gap. Mm -hmm. or, or, or You feel me? Even if it's not seen right then and there, some things might last to some degree. But right. eventually the, the, the foundation is, 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 is compromised. You feel me? Like, I, I can't, I use the, the building analogy so much. You feel me? When we build them, we build by brick, brick by brick, like right. masonry. You feel what I'm saying? And before, right. before those bricks is laid out, there's a blueprint. The blueprint is the most, is the most important thing. You feel me? Because everything is laid out on that. I'm saying we moving and we laying stuff down and it's, it's, it's holding up for some periods of time. And it's dropping. And it's dropping. Some ain't even making it to that point. Mm. Some is still waiting and under construction, you know what I'm saying? And all of it is being done without any any um, sustainable blueprint, you feel me? And me, in the time that I do have, I feel like I have the perspective, but I don't have the time nor the knowledge to really put that together. It's like I wish I had a lot of more older leaders, you feel me? Right. That, that have a following, have the, know what I'm talking about, know that, look at this, look at this young guy, see the way he looking at it and apply it to the ways that they've been doing it and hopefully that is stimulate will be the catalyst to a different result than what's been going on because don't get me wrong a lot of us leaders you know we come from a good place we have the right intentions but we all humans we all subjective and biased by nature right. so when we can learn to 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 differentiate de de excuse me i don't know how to really say that word but you get what i'm saying to to, right. to to separate and then see the similarities in that through a like a universal perspective then we'll always be able to pull from a think tank where we'll have sustainable ideas to build upon for any problems we face. You know what I'm saying? And I know I'm speaking very conceptually, but this is what I'm talking about when I'm saying those elder people with that, with those, with that material, you that substance facts, to put them. You feel speaking me? facts. What's your input on that, Kane? Like, I agree though. It gotta be. It, it do gotta be the ones that came before us, the backers. But we do gotta take in and. and I would say kind of carry that weight now, being that we got the youth, we right. got the energy, we got the strength, the vitality right now. It's not too many times where we have so much energy being focused on one area at one, one area. time. You feel right. what I'm saying? So I feel like as a people, like I, yo, if I was like 65, 70, yo, I would be nasty on really, you feel me? Because you got to understand the psychology of people and at the same time understand the psychology of the young cats. And I know that's what separates the older dudes from the younger dudes now. So it's like the young leaders need to come with the older leaders and we got to mesh together and implement a new a new type of way of going about. You feel what I'm saying? Because there's a lot of energy there and it's being wasted. Mm. That's what I feel. Honestly, it's being wasted. You feel me? There's a lot like I'm. it's so much to talk on. Like I say financial literacy, right? And this is something recently that i that i realized is is the most substantial thing in everybody life you need your whole life is dependent upon your financial literacy you understand like mm. right now the world is going through like a a financial shift like there's a shift in the wealth occurring right now right and a lot of people don't know about it due to the, some of the things that we're speaking about like you know what i'm saying a lot of the domestic things going on the, the justice and 
you know? But the fact of the matter is where it really count, this is what is not being publicized, you feel me? And I feel I feel that if us as a people was more conscious and aware of these type of things that we don't get triggered by because they try to they try to like distract Inside. us from it. Right. We'll get we'll see more the results that we're trying to reach through the means that we're trying to utilize it through, you feel me? Or trying to go through accomplishing it through. You feel me? Cause we're entering like we're entering a digital it's age. A great point, you feel me? Man. Like it, it, it's 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 the biggest thing. It's the biggest thing. You feel me? It's we are fighting it. All right, we work nine to five. You feel me? That's what eight hours, right? You sleep what another eight hours, right? That's sixteen hours, right? It's twenty four hours in a day, right? You left with eight hours to your time. You have children. You have people that you got. It's not enough time so for you. To, you left with no time. You 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 not you you a slave. You a slave. To your own well, we means live, of living. We living in a matrix, bro. And you feel what I'm saying? To tell right. people. And then my whole thing is this: bet. Let's live in the matrix, but let's 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 be the kings of the matrix. Let's really understand what we in, and and how to really capitalize as efficiently as effectively as we can within the matrix. You feel mm. me? I don't have to be succumb or pressed to the thing that I'm in. You feel me? If, if my perception wills it, I can find ways to utilize things in ways that people may not see or may see as something that deters them or may be detrimental may be the very thing to liberate me, you feel me? And it might sound weird to some, but that's how that works, you feel me? Somebody have to be the, somebody have to set the trend.